Wills, where exactly are we going? I told you where we we're gonna go already for that. You want to drop a beat? You say you said you know you got some you got some skills. So I'm taking you to my man's house. So you can't tell me how your man's is? I'm just saying that you know the less you know, the better it is. You just come in there and you know y'all fill each other out. That's all. I just wish I had a, a little. You know what I'm saying? I just wish I had a little introduction before I go meet somebody. Cause it would be nice to like expect something and I, you know what I mean? Because if I see this and he's not what I was expecting, I'm gonna look at him like, I don't know. So that's what I'm telling you. So what you expecting when it comes I'm, to- I'm a, a cool ass that comes out, like have all types of going on in his studio. Some weed, some music, makes me feel like, okay, I can, I can drop some heat. I just wanted to go to the studio just to play, just to have some fun, you know? Nothing serious. <laughs> Nothing serious. Ron, the man of the hour. How you doing? Good, how are you? I heard so much about you. I'm Yadi. Nice to finally meet you. I heard so much about you. I was Ron Lawrence. This man produced, hypnotized, um, money, power, respect, and, and the list goes on and on. So. I had a chance because even though I was playing about what I wanted to do, I still wanted to feel a little professional, you know what I'm saying? So I have to go holla at him. Yes, this is my best friend, Titi. Nice to meet you. Yes. Let's go listen to some music. All right, you know, let's try this thing. I've been trying to do this for a while now. So what do you feel about a lot of the reality stars that um, go out and make up music? What do you feel about that? I don't know any reality star that went out to make music on, um, unless it was Cardi B. Well, Cardi B's not the only one. Kim Kardashian made a song. Oh, well, that doesn't count, man. I'm going to work like I'm paying my bills. Spills my whole clicks on the floor, the floor. We gon' party, then party some more, some more. You, you said some, a reality star that actually made something out of music, right? I said that made some music. No, can't, oh man, that, that's probably was a joke too. I'm talking about, if you're talking about somebody that made, that made that out of something, that was Cardi, the only person I know. Okay. You know, Jocelyn, they try to do her thing. Oh, no, man. bitch, I guess this money, I'll fuck you all night and let you come uh, in my tummy. Uh, yeah, I said it uh, deep down in my God, gut. Man, man. Where that dick got, nigga, I wanna oh, and you know, those are like the few girls that I know off of reality, you know, TV. Kenzoliak did a, um, Who? party for the party. Oh, come on, man. That was a joke, too. Party all night and we won't go to sleep. We own the club, oh yeah, we own the life. And I am not leaving till I see daylight. Okay, so Joey claims Paris Hilton did something that was actually good. So did you hear the Paris Hilton track? Joe is, Joe is a unicorn, and Paris Hilton is another unicorn. Unicorns, they, they, they ride for each other. So Paris Hilton probably did some fun shit, and it do sound right, you know, for all this unicorn free spirit people in the world that I love so much. You know, the, LB, the LGBT community, that's what it's called, which I love y'all. And Paris made fun music, you know, like to dance and have fun. And you know, she did it like that. I, I can give her props for that. Let's talk about music. So why you want to rap? I don't want to rap. I just feel like I can, um. Can you sing? Um, maybe. Oh, so you just want to just test it out. You don't yeah, it. like I just want to see. I think I think I could sing a little bit. You know, I just want to just try it, like, you know. But yeah, I you mean, want to sing for me? I want to you know, huh? These, you know, do a little something. Like what? Nah, a little sing on the spot type. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I mean, you know how that feels. Oh, yeah, yeah, you know, that's how we tell like so. Drop a sixteen, like you put like people yeah. on the spot, like you know. Uh, uh, uh. But you know, I, I feel like I don't know. Maybe like a little, like a Spanglish little joint. You know, like. Are you shy to sing? Um, I just I think I just gotta be c get caught up in the moment. You know what I'm saying? Like I just gotta be in the booth and maybe like you know it will just flow out like that. I'm not I'm not trying to be a singer. So me 
you know, just go in front of somebody, just start singing. That's not my thing. You know what I'm saying? So I just gotta like just let myself float in the booth. Probably had to create or something like that. Mm hmm. I ain't got none of that, none of that, those type beats in my stash. I had to create some shit. But you know, I might, but it may take a minute to find it. But I can, I can play you some stuff, some hip hop stuff. Maybe you could find some melodies or something. I don't know, you know. Shit, you never know. Let me see. Uh, let me see where we start first. It's all hip hop stuff, though. like trap hip hop type shit. <laughs> Anyone? No, anyone. Music. What's music to you? You talk about anyone can just like me right now. I can just go in the booth and just sing. You talk about that, or you talk about somebody that's actually an artist. Like it was born to do that. Like okay, it's a difference because not everyone can do that. Not at all. Shit, I believe 95% of the motherfuckers is out there right now rapping and singing. I don't even know how they made it that far. But you know, that's the type of that goes on nowadays. You dance too, you dance? I can, I can do my little moves. Little All right. mm. Oh, I like this. I like this one. I changed this though, because you gotta let me know what kind of section you like. today's music that's just first of all if any of you guys be watching my shit, you know I'll be rocking with like you know the type of music I like like you know I like that like the early 2000s you know what I'm saying late 90s type of vibe I don't like none of this new shit that goes on now Yaddy roll her shit. <laughs> Ron didn't ride my shit. Yaddy rolled it. <laughs> now, bitch, come outside. Uh, uh, uh. I like this. So, what you gonna do? You gonna rap or something? I'm just flowing. Like, just flowing. She's yeah. At first, I was kind of nervous because, you know, so serious. You know, you get there, he barely talk. He looked like a fing. He look like Rakim, you know, the, the rapper Rakim. So I'm already feeling like, damn, you know, how can I, this nigga looking at me like, first of all, you don't rap, you don't do nothing. Like, what are you about to do? So I just felt like, you know, I didn't know what to do. So mm, that little experience was actually like, wow, like this is how this feel when they come to the studio and they meet a uh, producer and be mad uncomfortable if you don't know the person. But it was good. He made me feel good. He gave me a hot. Well, he gave me plenty of options. easy as it seems because first of all you got to write some shit and if you want to if you want to write your own stuff and you want to rap about your own shit you got to make sense so it's a lot of thinking and you got to rhyme together and you got to make sense and and people got to approve it like it's kind of like it's kind of hectic because sometimes you think it but it don't sound right when you write it down so it's like it takes a little time we got to figure out how we can get that I think I'm gonna have to take that word out because it's making it too long. Okay. I ain't talking to you nice. You gonna have to pay the price. Yeah, I'm taking this off. 
Like, it's nothing to to just go in there, oh, yeah, let's do this. No, it takes time. Now I see why it's like hours in the studio. It's like about 12 block, 24 block, whatever they call the studio shit. Now I see why, because that shit takes time. time I think you did pretty well first time coming listening to a beat and actually writing yeah so I'm, I'm impressed so you know it, it all it only get better as time goes yeah along. exactly and yeah, I like it I actually effort. enjoy doing this I don't know what it is like I like it yeah but sometimes you never want to go with the first thing that you do so I would take take it home listen absorb it you may want to change if you were after a day or so you may listen to it like you know what I can change this line or I can change that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And the more and more you get it, the tighter it's going to get. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So definitely for your first shot, I think, you, you know, it's Thank so you. impressive. I really yeah. appreciate that. Yeah. I'm definitely going to Because it seems it. like you know what you want while you're rhyming. And, and I'm listening to it and it does make sense. So, Nikki's your favorite rapper, right? As far as lyrics, you say, she you delivers said, it like, you so know, you said I Nikki, like it. you said, who Remy, else? Remy, I like Remy. Yeah. I like the old Kim. You like old Kim? Go home, listen to them, study how they. Their flow, right? Study their flow, how they deliver, and everything else. And you know, you kind of want to just try to apply it to what you do. You got your own style, but just kind of listen to how they flow and stuff, mm -hmm. and just apply it to that, you know. And then um. Uh, just, just keep doing it, and then you, you want to perfect the lines and stuff, and kind of go back. You may want to change certain things. Just live with what you write, live with it, and listen to it come back, and then see if you may want to tweak some things and mm -hmm. change some lines, change some words, whatever. But this is your first time, so um, I don't want to say settle for what you got right now. Because there's room to improve. Yeah, there's room for improvement, mm -hmm. and it's your first shot, so. I'm not done yet, so I need to add some little stuff, but it's gonna come out good. It's gonna come out real good, and I can't wait to show you guys, like, you know, I can do that too. I can do that too. Okay, so then I need you to be like, just to save yourself, be like, listen, this is hard. It's not for everybody. Don't be telling me to save myself. <laughs> Why, because you, you think I'm going to be that bad? Don't be fucking trying me like that. That's just, first of all, I'm about to go off on your ass on camera. First of all, guys, I'm not going to save nothing because I'm not going to save my ass. I'm going to do good. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna commit myself and to tell you guys, it may not sound like some Grammy shit, but it's gonna be, you know, shit. You got, you got the city girls. You got, you got, you know, you got girls just doing, doing them. What the fuck can do me? I'm gonna put out a song and it's gonna sound just fine. You're gonna see. I don't have to save my ass. So I'm not gonna lie to my supporters. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.